Hey guys, it's the Soul Cloth here, and today in today's Monster Legends Guides video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a good team in order to complete the new marathon. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so the first thing that you need to do is go into the global chat or in the team chat of Monster Legends, and then you click on global on the top left, and then you can click join and then join the Discord server. Once you've joined the Discord server, you will be brought to this screen right here. This is the rules and information section. I can move my face over so that you can see that on the left and it is under the official tag if you go down to the team hall tag you can see all of these things these are the ones that we are going to want to look at so you can ignore the first two but you are going to want to look at find a team find a team beginners recruit members or recruit beginners or recruit experience then you can ignore the last three all right so by looking in these middle ones you will be able to find a team if you go to recruit members recruit beginners or recruit experience and if you want a team to find you you can go to find a team or find a team beginners but that is a much less effective way in my opinion so i'm just going to click on recruit members you can click on recruit beginners or experience depending on what you are but i'm going to click on this one and then you can see a bunch of teams in here all right so while looking for a team you are going to want to only look at the teams that actually have their race log on here because if they don't it probably means that they're not doing too well and you also want to look at the war log well you can look at the war log but it doesn't matter as much so the race log is really good for seeing how they did in the last races of course and you can also see the placements don't really look at the placements they'll only look at the laps if they got at least 10 laps in the last race then they should be good and then when you're looking at the war log you can see if they are active if any of their teammates have gone inactive since the last race but if they have at least 100 to 200 war coins they should be good to go so once you find a good team you can go and join it but make sure to look at what we need you for or the rules or whatever they put up here because there are rules for some teams where you have to like spend a certain amount of gems and if you don't have that amount of gems don't join the teams because they will most likely kick you but if you meet all the requirements for the team stuff like that you can go and join it this one seems actually very good so if you meet all these requirements go and join this team and yeah that is pretty much how you're going to find a monster legends team let me know down in the comments if you still need a team or if you already found a team and then people can comment on your comment and invite you to theirs as well yeah don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next one goodbye